फर्स्ट थिंग्स फर्स्ट हाँ जी वॉट्स द वॉट्स द ओपन सोर्स मैगजीन स्टोरी आई मीन वेर इज इट नाउ वॉट आर द वॉट आर द चैलेंजेस अड सो ओपन सोर्स मैगजीन पर से वॉज ऑलवेज अबाउट यू नो एक्सप्लेनिंग एंड रादर एक्सेलरेटिंग डेवलपमेंट एंड डिप्लॉयमेंट ऑफ ओपन सोर्स दैट वॉज दी होल गोल and thankfully from a goal perspective i believe we've uh, it's been achieved not just by the magazine but overall as a country i think we've done pretty well uh, how many years uh, old it's 19 years in publishing wow. right the 20th wow. year anniversary we were celebrating in january right uh, for the publication right and frankly i think when we started even i think uh, uh, you'd remember there was a lot of discussion used to be whether, whether india contributes or not etc right uh, but now that discussion is no longer there like in this event we have about seven indian projects being discussed and there are many more which are also been discussed on the sidelines right so the, definitely india is not only contributing to mnc projects but is also developing its own projects and getting contributors globally so that goal is achieved but from a publications perspective print media is facing certain headwinds very strong headwinds so we are facing those too uh, but online is doing well and the event is uh, has got very good response uh, again this time after 3 years is being held so we are very happy that about a thousand plus people have turned up on day 1 right and a lot of people from the community have turned up to share yeah. their thoughts wisdom just like it rahul what's the story of electronics for you which is another big ban entry started by your grandfather i believe and played played a huge role in uh, building the electronics industry particularly north of the windias for some geographical reason which i have never understood <laughs> yeah no actually uh, so electronics you was started by my father father my grandfather helped him because he was from a journalism background my father was basically an engineer from iit madras right so he had no idea about journalism but he had the idea about electronics so my grandfather helped him from there okay right so it was a father son kind of a combination there the role was also pretty similar as open source there there it was about uh, development of electronics and sa- uh, sale and use of electronics and that time electronics was what i think open source was about 20 years ago right so electronics was in 1969 at that ic had just been announced so so my dad had just passed out of uh, uh, electrical engineering but i think it was called low voltage electrical engineering at that point point of time i see so, so he focused on the electronics and he he used to read this magazine called popular electronics which he used to buy second hand and he thought that there was a need in india also for engineers to have some something and something more localized so he launched the publication and we've been lucky that it's survived lucky, it's hard work grown, it's hard grown work. for 50 years plus 50 years and plus. still doing well and we've got some very good um, so it's how do you like, judge its impact any way of judging its impact uh and difficult the uh, the impact is that a lot of people say that their careers got changed some businesses got launched because of what they did at uh, red and electronics field right and uh, recently we heard that even our uh, current uh, main minister right uh, in an award speech mentioned that he got first time uh, aware about electronics from the magazine i see right and he said this in a public forum right which was also an interesting so so we believe that possibly the fact that india is a tech nation has got something to do with the fact that electronics spread at the right time right and that led to the next revolution last question you think we have enough tech magazines in india we need more no i think we need more because uh, oh, the recent now that's an interesting one do we need magazines or do we need content through different platforms okay is something i am not so sure okay right i i would be mistaken to say that we need magazine because this is something we ourselves are waiting for to find out from our readers and audiences whether print is needed or not yeah right but there is definitely lot of areas in which tech is playing a role but it's not getting showcased or discussed or even the creation of tech is not fully getting discussed like there used to like be earlier, areas like for example uh, besides open source also there's a lot of development that happens but nobody is focusing on that right uh, there's a lot of it infrastructure uh, challenges which are coming in new technology but nobody is focusing on that right so so there is a lot of other aspects related to technology right which unfortunately all those uh, media houses or platforms got very badly impacted right 
maybe during Corona or earlier, yeah. right? I'm not so sure, but there is definitely a, a, a shakeup that's happening, True. right? And now it's going to be the phoenix which rises from the ashes, right? And hopefully, uh, take you. it from there. Thank you so much. All the best. Most welcome.